just get ready for the day. So let's do that. Okay, señoras y señores, so I already got ready. I did something super uber simple today because está calientísimo afuera. I already feel it inside the house. So I was like, let me just do something simple. Um, so this is the makeup look. And then I chose this beautiful summer dress that I completely love. <laughs> Running some errands today and going on a little lunch date. So I'm super, super excited to take you guys with us. I'd like to see where we go, what errands we do, then come along with us. Esperada, chochos. Ok, señoras y señores, so ya regresamos de la tienda de hacer todos, todos nuestros errands. Vamos de comer, era the last place that we went to before we came home, and guys, the food was delicious. <laughs> um, but I wanted to kind of give you guys like a little bit of a haul of everything that we got at the store. Fuimos a dos tiendas, fuimos a Jojo's, which is Joe Osco. Um, it's like a local store around us and we went to Walmart so I'm gonna just show you guys everything um, and do a little haul for you guys I usually like to do all the cold stuff first so that's what we're gonna do things that I have here first are gonna be the two cheeses that we get we actually get these for the noodles that my husband does that are so delicious um, but I have those they're from Lucerne I don't think we've ever tried Lucerne have we been? This is the first time we've tried these ones. My husband got a Stouffer's lasagna with meat sauce. This one's actually really good. Then we got some Daisy sour cream. We love Daisy in our house. Um, signature select yellow mustard. <laughs> it's so cute, guys, because in our house, I love how our house is set up. I have a window in the kitchen, and I can literally see my dog running around outside right now. It's the cutest thing ever. Another thing that we got, I didn't even know Rouse had this. If you guys haven't tried the Rouse, like, pasta sauce or Alfredo sauce, it's literally bomb.com. But we found these, and they're the four cheese ravioli with marinara sauce. I'm gonna see how my husband likes those and then we just got some more of the meat sauce. We got some uh, great value 1% milk. Usually I do the 2% but no tenían so I just have to settle for the 1% milk. And I got some um, Hellman's Real Mayo. Next one that I have is the Hillshire Farm um, I didn't get the black forest tan. Smoke tan. Does that taste bad? No, but it didn't taste like black forest. <laughs> That's what I get for trying to record at the store, no, guys. This is what I have to do. This is my life. Oh, this is my life. Oh, my black forest and? Um, I got the Hillshire Farm small town, guys. Usualmente agarramos the black, for black forest ham. But I'm a dummy, I got this time. So we're just gonna have to suck it up. <laughs> I got these um, Hillshire Farm Little Smokies. Uh, my husband loves these ones and um, they're super easy to make. So we got some of these. And then we got some of the Great Value Colby and Monterey Jack cheese sticks. If I've not tried these, I would say give this a go. Um, these go really fast in our home. Next thing that I have are Hot Pockets. They are, they are the Hickory Ham and Cheddar Crispy Buttery Crust. I love these things, so I had to get at least a five pack. I did get some mangoes because they're really my most favorite thing and I love them to be like rock hard. The mangoes that are more like soury and not too sweet. So I got two of these because they were on sale. And then I got this big old sandia because we love sandia in this house. And guys, it was on sale. It was like 
two dollars for this one when it's usually like 14 bucks speaking of rolls we got the rolls homemade alfredo sauce best thing ever for my little baby boy my puppy loves the full moon treats so we ended up getting him um just to try out the savory sticks this is our first time trying them out should get the full moon like chicken ones and these are beef recipe so we'll see if he likes it and some plates regular regular ended up getting guys some arizona fruit punch now i had gotten this but it was um i think i had gotten them at walmart but they were in like a plastic bottle and i feel like with the can bottle tell me if i'm not tell me if i'm the only one or if i'm not but i think in arizona's in a can just taste different they're like a nostalgia thing for me and so i had to pick up two of these when I see that they were in a can. So, and, and then the next thing that I got was this butternut large white bread. Guys, when we found these when we moved over here, I don't think we'll ever be going back because this bread is literally so nice and soft and never miss with the Coke. The pantry stuff, I ended up getting um, some fresh cut green beans, some regular beans, and then we got some Hormel chili for some chili bean dip that my husband makes as well. Some pasta. We got some penne regatta. Regate, regatta. <laughs> we got some penne, okay? Um, we got this for um, a dish that my husband makes, uh, cheesy noodles. Instead of getting some thick spaghetti. If you haven't been put on thick spaghetti, you're missing out, honey. And then we got just some fettuccine noodles infamous chips that literally guys i feel like i cannot find where we're at right now and so i literally have to get like two bags every time we find them um but they're the lace flame and hot chips i love these chips with um sandwiches so i ended up getting two of them i do get this big bag of cereal because i feel like it's like worth it because i eat cereal in the mornings we're just frosted flakes so getting some paper towels we got the four rolls we've never tried this brand so I'm curious to see how it works, but yeah. A couple of things are just meat. So we got some chicken, some ground beef, and at least pork chops. So that is going to be it for the haul. <laughs> okay, so basically, as I showed you guys, I got almost all of our meats for the week so that we can cook here at home. And I use my food saver to basically save all of our meats in the freezer. This thing is literally chef's kiss food saver is literally the best thing ever and such an investment because it keeps all of our meats super super fresh um and you know sometimes when you put just meats in the freezer they kind of get a little bit freezer dried or freezer burn or something like that i think that's what it's called um and so this keeps it super uber fresh so that is what i did with all of my meats and then i just put the dates that we got them and then the actual just the name of the meat um and so this is how all of our meats look just beautifully packaged um, I think for the rest of the day, we are going to be uh, watching a show that my husband and I, a new season just came out and we've been watching. Um, so we're going to be doing that. Show you guys a little bit of the show. So let's see if he likes them. Papash, come. Oh, oh, you do? Okay. <laughs> Okay, señoras y señores, so it is the end of the night. Um, as I showed you guys, my husband and I watched a little bit of The Bear. Literally, we've been obsessed with the show and we literally just finished the season. And I just want to say, what a way to end season three. <laughs> but anyways, um, so now to finish off the day, this is pretty much going to be my day. Um, after this, I'm pretty much just going to chill, just... Yeah, I'm pretty much just going to chill after this, so I kind of wanted to just jump on here and just tell you guys that's the end of it. I'm going to be taking off my makeup now. I'm taking off all of my jewelry. And yeah, so I'm really glad that you guys came along. Thank you guys so much so much for watching and please don't forget to like comment and subscribe 
um just so you don't miss any of my future videos guys so so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next one